here at the uh, John Deere Develop with Deere Conference. I'm speaking with Pat Pinkston. And first of all, Pat, what do you do for John Deere? Well, I'm the Vice President for Technology and Information Solutions. I have the advanced technology for components for the Intelligence Solutions Group, as well as I have all the off-board uh, management of, of the data and the My John Deere website. So I know this is a conference that uh, has been held for a couple years, kind of an evolution like everything we're going through in technology. What is it you're trying to accomplish with this uh, developers conference? We believe that in order to bring the total value to the producer, to help them as far as productivity and efficiency, that we need to connect with the very best capabilities in the industry and integrate that together. Mm -hmm. So this conference is about really reaching out to those people, especially in the agronomic side, but also on the, the logistics and other pieces of it, and bringing that together with the equipment and finding a way to enable that producer with an entire solution. Mm -hmm. And we're focused this year on trying to really move it to the next level and, and engage directly with these developers that are here and try and find a way to bring their capabilities and connect it up with our platform. Well, it, when you talk about being connected with your platform, essentially you've made a bold move, if I understand this, in kind of opening up your APIs for third-party uh, company uh, applications. Have you had, um, or how should, uh, how would you describe the uh, results so far? Have you been able to create some applications with these developers? So, you know, we've been, uh, we've, this is now either the third or fourth year for this conference, and uh, we've got a number of companies where we have shared APIs with them today. We've probably got over 80 that are in progress. Uh, this is not really a, a significant change in direction uh, relative to the openness. We have been open yeah. and continue to be open relative to the sharing of the data. Um, we are, I think, looking at how we can go from beyond just sharing data mm -hmm. to actually bringing the value back into the customer to try and find a way to integrate that, that capability, that functionality that the data enables and maybe connect it up with multiple parties and provide a more holistic and total solution. Ultimately, it's about making sure that we can get the information from the field and be able to, to actuate and execute in the field those, uh, those insights and those capabilities so that the producer can be assured that what they pay for they get and what they can learn is available to them. Now, I know uh, you told us today John Deere has a pretty big goal for 2015 to be the preeminent platform in the ag industry. Um, and you also mentioned, I think, to the developers here that that's really only going to be possible with them being able to work with you to to accomplish that, right? I mean, first of all, I think we'd say that we are the preeminent platform already. No one has more of the components, more of the capabilities uh, than John Deere. Everything from mm -hmm. the, the sensors that are on the machines to the embedded capabilities to now integrating mobile devices in the machine to the My John Deere platform. No one else has that complete solution. With that, though, it's not a total solution for the customer. So finding a way to integrate and, and connect up these other other parties and bringing them in and first of all enabling them with data and then ultimately yeah. connecting back their insights is where we think we need to get to and that we're committed to, to make that happen. Well, uh, we're doing this um, interview with what I affectionately call Zim Glass, uh, uh, Google Glass, and you know, it looks to me, by I know I know some of the people here, this is an ag nerd's paradise, you know? Yeah. So, uh, and we uh, need those guys. We do, we do. Uh, well, thank you very much, Pat. I know we've got uh, breakout sessions coming up on uh, either technical wor workshops, uh, uh, things that John Deere is doing in terms of uh, business new products and services. Yeah, business stream and so, a technical stream yeah. to both look at the business side of this and where we're going as well as what are the technical aspects, specific technical aspects of connecting this up. Well, I am so glad to have the opportunity to be back with you again this year and here from Kansas City where we're at Develop with Deer. I'm Chuck Zimmerman reporting. Thank you so much.